The delegation included police liaison officers from Australia, Belgium, Chile, France and Germany, and a United Nations regional security advisor. The guests visited a local police stations at a law enforcement and a case handling center in Guiyang, the capital of Guizhou province. The center integrates law enforcement, case handling and detainees port services. It features high-tech storage facilities for detainee belongings and the provision of medical care. Interrogation areas are furnished with softer materials to avoid accidents and young detainees are held in a designated room. We are really uh, understand that you are improving some uh, new systems and we are uh, really interested uh, to learn about that uh, because you have a uh, really high standards and I, I, I am trying to uh, trying to explain to my people in, in Chile because uh, our police uh, don't have this kind of system, of this kind of uh, buildings, but it's, uh, I think it's a really good uh, new technology to apply for crime investigation. The tea industry is key to the economy of Guizhou's Pu'an County, which now has over 12,000 hectares of tea plantations. China's Ministry of Public Security provided over 10 million yuan, or 1.4 million US dollars, to help Pu'an build over 660 hectares of tea plantations in 2020. The ministry also supports a school for the children of families relocated under China's poverty alleviation policy. Established in 2019, the facility integrates primary, middle and high school. The ministry also provides teaching staff. Police officer Chen Yan is now an English teacher at the school. It's very meaningful to teach here. The children here know little about the world outside. When I just came here, asking them if they'd like to visit Beijing or other cities in the world, they answer no. So in English language teaching, I introduced the UK to them using pictures as I went to a university there. And many students were inspired that they wanted to visit it right after the introduction in the class. The delegation at the school received a warm welcome from the students and staff, and the members were impressed. This is a fantastic uh, school, a very big, and it's a very good idea. The community police help uh, the community here and people to start learning from this age and to give them all of these sports, taking care of them. This is, uh, of course, in the future, give them a very bright future. For these guests, the visit to Guizhou province offers a good opportunity to learn the local operations and the frontline duties. And it's the exchanges just like this one that are enabling China to communicate and cooperate with the rest of the world further. Zheng Song, CGTN, Guizhou province.